Hello. Hello. And welcome back to Pup Pup Enters the Race. <laughs> this time it's gonna work. Uh, I've, I've redone my technical setup and we're gonna speed run the first part of this game so I don't repeat a lot of what we've done. We didn't actually get that much done the first time we tried to play this game. Um, but now all the puzzles should work. Maybe I'll try to start with that puzzle that I got stuck on last time. Um, I don't know that we can. I think there's other stuff we have to do first, but it'll be great. Um, yeah, so I'm working with a new technical setup. Uh, I've killed it. Okay, so there's a possum, not an armadillo. Right, so stuff in this game changes. This isn't the same save file because I don't know how to transfer it from the Mac half of my laptop to the Windows partition. So Okay, pet, give it a try. So I just said let's restart it and do the speed run. Good boy, pet. Quote unquote Gosh, speed run. Sure hope we didn't scare that little guy too much. Well, I guess I can keep on driving. Yep. Car town speedway, here I come. Okay, I hope we don't have to listen to that song again. <laughs> Oh, we can totally skip that. Great. And we never have to look at that paper. Actually, let's look once. Got it. Oh, we don't even have to listen to the whole spiel. Okay, great. This is very much an episode two. If you're lost, if you're confused, go back and watch the first video. It's not very satisfying. Warning. Um, but uh, now we're gonna do the tasks. We're gonna get our um, high octane gasoline, which we need a tank for, radial racing tires, which we gotta go to the tire store, safety helmet, and a flag. And it's a triangle flag and we need the number three on it. Okay. Um, I guess we can still visit these places. It's the car town wash. There might be bottles and stuff to pick up. And now we actually have full capabilities of enjoying this game and not, you know, worrying about, pardon, whether or not uh, the mechanics will work. Free. Those batteries must be free. Great. These might come in handy. They will. They will come in handy. I don't think there's anything else we have to do here. Uh, just pick up those batteries. Maybe there's a bottle here. Car town color. Whoa, it would be great to get a new paint job. We're gonna have to get a paint job at some Whoa, point. Whoa, it's an empty bottle. That doesn't belong there. I think I'll recycle it. Save the earth. Save this terrifying neon earth that you live on with colorful cars that talk. Uh, we don't actually need anything here. I don't know why I went here. Um, we have quests for the Italian man, and then... Yeah. Hello. Good morning, a putt putt. Good morning, Mr. Baldini. I'm getting ready to race in the Car Town 500. Oh, that is so exciting. You let me know if there's anything I can do to help you. Thanks, Mr. Baldini. I will. We will need honey from you, or possibly something else, depending on if the animal has changed that we need to buy food for. Hey, yeah, but, but I'm getting a little low on produce. How'd you like to do me a favor and go out on the farm and tickle me up some more, huh? Sure. What do you need, Mr. Baldini? Well, uh, let me see. 
I need a one of tomato, a one of ear of corn, and a one of bunch of broccoli. Okay, I can get that. Excellent. You bring them back to me in this box, and I'll give you two coins, but but. Gee, thanks. I could use some coins, Mr. Baldini. Great. Uh, well, a good luck. Bye. I think those are the same foods we had to get last time. It's kind of weird. Hey, it's red? Hey, Question mark? an empty bottle! I've been meaning to get that recycled. Say, Putt-Putt, if you wouldn't mind, could you take it to be recycled for me? Yes, yes. sir, Smokey! I'd Smokey, not red. To. Oops. <laughs> Thanks, little fella. That's a big help. Do you need a ladder or something? So, Putt-Putt, are you going to race in the car town 500? I sure hope Oh, we so, need his Smokey. ladder. Okay. There's just a few things I have to get first. Well then, I'm sure you'll have no trouble. Okay, okay. Here we go. Continuing with the speed run. Oh, it's Chuck. Hey, it's Chuck! And it looks like he's in trouble! Oh, we have to oh, talk to him. How's my little buddy? I'm fine, Chuck, but what happened to you? Oh, one of my rubber radios hit a nail, popped it like a balloon. <laughs> I'm one stuck, Chuck. Maybe I can help. If you would, I'd be a happy tow truck. How's about heading over to my tire setter and picking me up a tire patch kit? And judging by my tire, you'll need to cut it into a triangle. Oh, I can do that, Chuck. Thanks, little buddy. I'd be much obliged. All right, all right. Picking up quests left and right in the speed run. Here we go. Oh my god. It's an emu. This is exciting. Hi, Outback Al. Putt Putt, are you a sight for sore eyes? Good to see you, matey. Good to see you too. Say, are you saving that empty bottle for recycling? Not saving it exactly, matey. It's been sitting gathering dust. You're welcome to take it. Please. Gee, thanks. <laughs> Hello. Hi, Al. This little emu was shipped here all the way from my hometown. In Australia, that is. Well, he's very cute. Wow, I guess we don't need to help. Also, where's... are we supposed to get a flag from him? Maybe later. Ooh, jams. Pud Pud, hello. Hi, Mrs. Airbag. How are you doing today? I'm afraid not very well. Ralphie buried Mr. Airbag's new hubcaps in the backyard. Mr. Airbag's not going to be too pleased about that, I can assure you. Maybe I can help you dig them up, Mrs. Airbag. Oh, Putt-Putt, that would be wonderful. Great! Now all I have to do is find a shovel, and I'll be back. Thank you so much, Putt-Putt. It's, isn't it kind of boring when you just know where everything is? <laughs> like, we know how to get the shovel. Oh, the cat's under the house. Hello, Mr. Fender Bender. Well, if it isn't Tip Tip, why you'll never guess. I mean, never guess what happened. Bonzo, my cat, ran straight down this hole, and now he won't come out from under the house. <laughs> Gosh, I don't think I can reach in there. But maybe I can find something that will make him want to come out, Mr. Fender. Probably Bender. milk. Well, if you did, that would be the cat's bow wow. I mean, the cat's meow. Okay. So we need milk at some point. Um, that's the library. I don't know if we need anything from there at the moment. Maybe we hey, should learn about emus. Odd animals of the alphabet. I'd like to take a look at that. E for emu. E. It can't fly, yeah. That's true. Okay. That was demonstrated to us by the fact that it was trying to fly. Amazing. Something's on fire? No, it's not. Hmm. Things are changing in this game. I think I'll pick up this empty bottle and recycle it. Or maybe I'm just doing stuff out of order. Um, you know what? I'm gonna go this way. Cause 
this guy. Hi, Put Put. Where are you going? I was hoping to head over the hill, Pete, but Pete. it looks like the road's blocked. It sure is. I lost my hook somewhere this morning. I heard it drop off with a clank, but I don't remember where. Without my hook, I can't move even one of these pipes. I don't know what to do. Maybe I can find your hook for you. Oh, but, but that would be so great. I could get this job done and be done in time to go see the Car Town 500. Okay, Pete. I'll keep my eyes open. I hope it's still in the same location. I guess we'll see. Three bricks. We're gonna need some of those. The sign says three bricks. Those must be the bricks from the old building that used to be here. I think I'll take one. Oh, sweet. We're gonna need that for that guy's house that the cat's under. Hi, Betsy Bulldozer. Hey there, but but what's up? I was wondering if I could borrow your shovel. I need to help Mrs. Airbag, and it would sure come in handy. Ah, uh, you know I'd like to, but I got a heap of work ahead of me today. Only time I ever take a break is to suck down a big old fat milkshake. Of course, I forgot it today, so I'll be missing my break. I have a great idea, Betsy. If I bring you a milkshake, then you could take a milkshake break, and maybe then I could borrow your shovel. But I'm liking it. You're on. And make sure it's a really big one. Okay. Okay, can do. Oh, we can go this way. Do you mind if I pound in some of those nails back there? Oh. In fact, I could use some help. Got a load of these cheap nails. They keep popping out left and right all over the place. If you could smack them back in for me, you'd be doing me a huge favor. Okay, Betsy, I'll give it a try. I must have missed this last time. I don't know that it's necessary. Wow, look at all the nails. I'd better get to work. Here I go. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Okay. Is the tape measure the time limit we have? I think we're doing fine. If this is not necessary for the game, it's gonna kind of ruin the speed run. Yeah, I'm gonna guess Here we don't need to be doing nails. this. No, I, we, go. I'm not ready. Let's go. <laughs> Yes, we should. Yes, please. <laughs> Thank God. Guess what, Betsy Bulldozer? <laughs> Excuse me. I nailed in every last one of them. Now, why am I not surprised? Good work, Put Put. Say, I don't have much to give you, but I'd like to give you a kind of thank you gift. How about this genuine junior car town construction crew safety helmet? Perfect. Don't think it'll fit you, but it'll look great on your dog. Thanks a lot. We needed that. Amazing. Amazing. Yes, he has a hat now. Okay, great. I didn't even know that that was going to help us out. But it's just those little, those little things that you're like, maybe I'll just pound in a couple nails. And then it ends up being fully necessary. Um, let's go to the farm. I bet there's money in here. So yep. that's where I left my coin. That's not your coin, that's theft. But it's okay. <laughs> okay. Look at all the progress, folks. Look at all the progress. It's so exciting. Perfect, okay. So we need the flashlight from the farm, and then we can get Pete's hook. That's the same. It's Torval Tractor. May we have this? Wow, it's a flashlight! Hey, Pot Pot, you want that old thing? It's not really working. Do you know what's wrong with it, Torval? Oh, yeah, no <laughs> batteries. Go ahead and take it. Gee, thanks. Oh, don't you go mentioning it now. Perfect. Combine. I the batteries I got at the toy store will fit in this. Perfect. 
Great, okay. Let's go pick up that hook before we forget. Dude. It's a hook! I bet it's the one that Pete Crane lost! Okay, is there anything else in here that we would need to see? No? No, there's not. Okay. Let's go back to the farm. Just turn around real quick. And we needed... I took a picture so we didn't have to... We need tomato, broccoli, and corn. I don't remember where any of those are, but I remember going this way at some point. Or, uh, ending up there, I guess. Broccoli. Look, broccoli! I need some of those. I think I'll pick some. Perfect. Yeah, there's definitely something broken with my virtual machine installation on my Mac partition because it doesn't work as well. The navigation was miserable here and it's actually fine now. Um, it's just my own inability to pathfind that's holding us back. <laughs> Uh, I have a feeling I don't need to be going this way. Okay. <laughs> backtracking, backtracking. Did anybody else used to make like little maps on paper or like roads uh, for toy cars to go on? I remember doing that when I was little. Uh, I don't know where I got the toy cars from. Possibly as, like, you know, uh, Happy Meal toys from uh, films like Cars 2007. Or 2006? Maybe 2006. Um, but yeah, I used to make, like, little paper roads for them to go on. I also used to make paper laptops. Hey, tomatoes! I need one of those for Mr. Baldini. I think I'll pick it. Yes, we know. We know, Pup Pup. That's why we clicked it. <laughs> I used to make paper laptops and pretend that I was typing on a laptop uh, just with two 8.5 by 11 sheets of paper. One with a keyboard drawn, <laughs> drawn on it and the other with a screen. You get bored as a kid. You gotta do what you gotta do. Was there corn down here? No, just grapes. Okay. Music is a little staticky. I'm not sure what's causing that. Oh, corn. Oh, amazing. I wonder which way I should go to get there. You know, Papa, you don't have to wonder. I can't reach that from yes, here. Yes, you can. Friend, you totally can. I think the only reason why we have to do this whole maze navigation is to get money. Although there are other ways to get money, this may be an easy way to get two coins. We found one in the um, in the payphone. Oh heck. But I don't really know how else to get money. Um. But good that we got it done in a relatively timely manner. Would love to leave. <laughs> love to get out of here. Cool, cool. Bye! Okay. Enjoy the radio. Ah, oh, the songs, they end so quickly. Okay, here's your food, produce. Here you are. 
you go, Mr. Baldini. It's become green. Thank you, Putt Putt. And just like I promised, here's a two of coins. Hey. There's his two cents. You're welcome. And if you want to fill up another produce box, you just let me know. I would love to not do that. Uh, I'd love to get by with enough money. I think... Mm, I do kind of want to do the car wash because that sounds fun. And I do kind of want to paint the car red because I think that would also be fun. I don't remember how much each of those things costs. <laughs> um, or if we need money for like anything plot relevant. Here's the hook, Pete. Is it yours? Is it ever? But, but you are a great pal. Why don't you hook it back on me and I'll get these pipes moved. Perfect. Amazing. Teamwork. Thanks, but but Okay, stand back. I've got work to do. <laughs> All clear. Thanks again, but but It sure feels great to be able to work again. You're welcome, Pete. You know, Pete, what if you lived in a society where you didn't have to work? <laughs> well, I think there would be problems, I assume. Um, okay, so we got the tire shop where we can get Chuck's tire patch. Maybe let's start with that. Because we've never been here before. There we go. It's right outside. Wow, a bottle! I should recycle this! Ooh, we need those tires. Great! It's a tire patch kit! Chuck said I could take one so I can help him patch his tires. How did the tires get in there? Into this window. Now, all I have to do is go find some scissors so I can cut it out. Okay, at the library. So, when we're done here, we'll go to the library. Let us get Betsy Bulldozer and Milkshake. Welcome to Mars. <laughs> Hi, Rover. Hey, Putt Putt. Do you mind if I take this bottle for recycling? Of course not. It's all yours. Thanks. I seem to recall this being the mirror image of what it is appearing as, but maybe not. Uh, can we have- oh, we also could use milk. I'll have a carton of milk, please, Rover. Freshest you'll find anywhere, Putt Putt. Coming right up. There you go. Thanks. What it's do I owe free? You? Are you kidding? I owe you. I mean, you're the guy who brought me back from the moon. It's free to you, Putt Putt. Always. Gee, oh, that's Rover, right. That's really nice. It's the moon. That's really cold. Thanks, Rover. I think I'll save it for later. We also need a milkshake. I'll have a giant jumbo milkshake, please, Rover. Best and biggest in carton, Pot Pot. Coming right up. Here you go. Betsy will like this. Is it a strawberry milkshake? I have a question. <laughs> My question is, oh, they do, they must have cows because they have like animals and stuff. I'm just like, where does the milk come from? Cows? Probably cows. Okay, so it's, it's just, their society is as if you replaced humans with cars, I guess. Look at all the junk, yeah? Mm -hmm. I guess so. There's sure I guess a so. Yeah, isn't it great? Isn't it great? Okay. Well, here's some bottles. We're gonna make some money. I'll need to put in two more bottles yep. before I can oh. recycle them. Are you gonna say that every time? I'll need to put in one more bottle before <laughs> I can recycle them. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Amazing. A coin. This recycling machine sure is neat. It really is. Um, let's recycle all that we have. Do this puzzle. Boy, this is taking up a lot of time in the speedrun, isn't it? 
Pop pop just counting. I'll need to put in one more bottle before I can recycle them. Okay. Talking to no one, Putt Putt. Excuse me, Mr. Crane. He's not listening to you. Sure is an awfully big mess. Whew. You're telling me. Accidentally bumped into those shelves this morning and nearly twisted my lug nuts. I can hardly bend over to put all that stuff back on the shelf. Oh, don't worry. I can put it back for you. You do that, and I'd be more tickled than a newly tuned turbo engine. Have to warn you, though. There's only one way everything fits. Stuff is packed in there pretty darn tight. Okay, Mr. Crankcase, I'll remember that. Okay, I am deeply nervous. Things seem fine at the moment. But they did also on the other virtual machine <laughs> at first. So don't get your hopes up. This might be, this might not end well. Um, it, it might also be fine. Ooh, that's too easy. Ooh, I don't know. I'm leaving it till the end. Um, so yeah, how have you all been? <laughs> you all who can't respond to me. Oh. doesn't make a very pleasant noise when you're wrong. Well, things are going good. Hmm. Uh-oh. <laughs> How did this happen? Oh, maybe the duck. Oh, there we go. The duck was wrong. There we go. Well, it's all Perfect. Done. Wow. Sure was a lot of fun, what do we get? Thanks for letting me help. No, thank you. You're the one who needs to be thanked. You're very welcome, Mr. Crankcase. We don't... We didn't even get anything. That was pointless. Oh, no. Okay, well... I'm a little discouraged. A little, just a little bit. It's fine though. Let's go cut out the patch for Chuck. He said he needed a triangular patch. Hey, those safety scissors might come in handy to cut the tire patch kit for Chuck. They might. They will. They, uh, right now, they will. I need to cut this tire patch kit for Chuck. Now, which shape did Chuck need his tire patch kit cut into? A triangle. I think I'll start over with a new sheet. There we go. That shape is a triangle. Oh, jeez. Mm, that's not right. I should try to cut along the lines. I am. <laughs> I'm doing my best. Put, put. try to cut along the line. That's not the right shape. I think I'll get a new sheet and try again. But that shape is a square. It, it was I the right shape. I need a new sheet. That's a triangle. Okay, Putt Putt. I'm literally doing the best that I can do. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I've messed it up. Okay, he's not complaining. This is so close to a triangle. Great! Oh, I thank a God. Triangle. Now I can help Chuck fix his flat tire. Good, good. Okay. Um oh, I forgot to drop off the milkshake to get the shovel. Okay, let's do that. <laughs> yeah, totally makes sense. Okay. Betsy. Here's your milkshake. Here you go, Betsy. What do you think? One giant jumbo 
milkshake. Thanks a bunch, Hutlet. There's Thanks nothing a bunch. like taking a break Jennifer and Coolidge. drinking a giant jumbo milkshake. Say, I was wondering, Betsy, since you're on your break, would you mind if I borrowed your shovel? I need it to help out with the snare bag. You go right ahead, Putt Putt. I won't be able to do any work during my milkshake break. Just make sure you return it as soon as you're done, so I can get back to work. Okay, Betsy Bulldog. Will do. Will I do. will. Thanks. Okay. Let's do that now, then. Um, <clears throat> so we need to go to Mrs. Airbag's house? Hello, Putt-Putt. Did you find a shovel? Mm -hmm. I sure did. Now I can go dig up Mr. Airbag's four hubcaps. Wonderful. Four. All you have to do is head around to the backyard. Ralphie will show you the way. Thanks, dog. Oh my god. Oh. Horrible memories. Nope, nothing in there. Do you see? Do Are you, you see? To tell me something, Ralphie? Should I dig over there? That hole's empty. Oh well. I'd love to dig where you're standing. Trapped the dog. <laughs> I don't see anything here. Maybe Ralphie's trying to tell me where he buried the hubcaps. Oh my gosh. I understand. He barks louder when your mouse is near it, maybe? I don't think I knew about that mechanic, or maybe it didn't work on my computer uh, when I was little. <laughs> I remember just digging and digging forever. Nope. There's a different animation when, when there is a hubcap. Or maybe not. Sweeper? Is that what that's called? <laughs> Let's go, Pop Pot. We know. We're just we got two more to go after this. Okay, Ralphie. Now would be a good time to refill your beverage. Wow, that was fast. Okay, finish refilling your beverage. <laughs> the world's the world's moving on. We've completed the digging puzzle. Huh? Wait. <laughs> Some ancient treasure? Mr. Airbag will be so happy. You 
okay to keep the gas can, but but you um. earned it. Gee, thanks. Now that's now I guess I better return the shovel to Betsy. Don't you worry about that, Putt Putt. I'll do it for you. Thanks, Mr. Oh, Fairbag. great. That is a car that knows what she wants, and what she wants is to sell this treasure on car eBay. It belongs to the museum, but alas. Okay, uh, Chuck, we have your patch. Here you go, Chuck. Here's your tire patch kit, cut into a triangle. Why, Putt Putt, are you ever something? Why don't you slap that thing on me so I can be on my way? Okay, here goes. Amazing. Bounce, bounce. Good as new. Thanks to you. Well, I better get rolling. <laughs> Drop by the tire center anytime, Putt Putt. I'd be more than happy to give you a deal on a new set of tires. Wow, I could use a set of super speedy radial racing tires for the big race. Well then, come on down, little buddy. I'll make you a deal of a lifetime. See ya. What, what's that deal? Do we need, like, to get more money than we have? I'd love to know. I also forgot we have milk for the cat and a brick to fill in the wall. We brought the milk. I have some milk, Mr. Fender Bender. Maybe that would do the trick. By all means. I mean, by all means. Give it a try. Convenient dish. Here, kitty. Here, Fonzo. Come and get it. My pings and pistons, you did it. <laughs> Compress. Now I'd better be oh, on the safe side cover up that hole so he doesn't go bolting down there again. Ooh, though. probably not a good thing to cover it with. Wow, a racing flag. Yep, genuine certified. Real good at hugging poles, too. I mean, plugging holes. Gee, I sure could use a racing flag. <laughs> um, Happy to give it to you, Pit Pit. If you find me something else to plug up the hole. How about the free no, brick? Mr. Fender Bender, I think I might have something that will work. Peachy son, let's have a look. So in this version of the game, the cat does not get stuck up the tree. And Mr. Fender Bender gives us the flag instead of the Outback Owl <laughs> guy. Is that his name? Ranger Rick? It's definitely not that now. <clears throat> it's a brick! Couldn't be perfect. It's a brick! I mean, more perfect, son. Slide her on in there. Perfect fit! You go ahead and keep that flag. I certainly have no need for it anymore. Okay, well, great. Thanks, Mr. I think Fender we have everything Fender. we need except now for the tires. Ah, oh, that's right. I think we can do that at the library. Oops. Sorry to disturb you, bird. Uh, numbers. Hey, neat! I bet these numbers would work great on my triangular racing flag. What number are we? I think we're three. Yes, official number three. We used to be number one, but we got demoted. Look at all the numbers! Red <laughs> It's all of them. My official number on my racing flag. Except for zero. Let's see. I think he said I need a three. That one's three. That's the number I need for my flag. Mm hmm Great. Oh, nice. Okay. So we gotta go get those tires. Then we have to get gas. And before we get gas, I'd like to check the price on a paint job and a car wash because we have to experience those things before we complete the game. Ooh, another bottle. Maybe have it. Hey, it's a bottle. Do you mind if I recycle this, Chuck? Of course not, little buddy. Take it. It's yours. Thanks. Okay, how about those tires? Chuck. I was wondering if I could buy a set of those super speedy radial racing tires. Redline Rick says these are the kind I need to enter the Car Town 500. Best tire on the market. Am I ever going to make you a deal since you helped me out today? Gee, thanks, Chuck. How much are they? Normally, they're two coins a piece. But for you, I'll give you all four tires for only four coins. That's oh. the savings of four whole coins. 
That's a great deal. Yeah. But it means it's gonna break the bank. Here you go, Chuck. Four coins. Thank you kindly, Putt Putt. Now I'm gonna have to measure you with these calipers to make sure those tires will fit you. <laughs> Don't worry, it ain't gonna hurt. Well, well, a perfect fit. Putt Putt, perfect. you just bought yourself some primo top of the line super speedy oh, racing racing tires. Would you like me to put them on you now, or would you like to wait until race time? I don't want to race around Car Town too fast, so I'll just put them on at the track. I remember that animation. <laughs> okay, bye. Hmm, okay. Well, we don't have three bottles to recycle. What does this do? It blows a bubble. That blows a bubble too. Um, well, I don't think anything's one coin, huh? Can we get free money from anywhere else? Is there a... There's no fire. Wow. Maybe the fire is only if we end up, um, needing the ladder or something like that. Okay, now we have three bottles, which gets us one coin, then we end up with two coins. I don't know if we're gonna have enough money for both things. Both a, a car wash and a paint job. Huh. Maybe we don't need a paint job, you know? Maybe it's better to just race as putt putt, purple putt. But I do want to look at the inside of that place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put in one more bottle before I can recycle them. Maybe I'll fast forward. Um, if I deem it necessary to do both things, I'll fast forward so that you don't have to watch me go through the process of farming. Farm, literally farming, I guess, going and getting stuff. Yep. Okay, thanks, Papa. <laughs> Thanks for your monologue. Uh, if we go talk to Mr. Baldini, he'll give us two more coins. Um, this is, of course, entirely unnecessary. I think we can complete the game now. Um, but... I don't know. It's not a 100% speedrun if you don't uh, get a car wash and a paint job, is it? <laughs> okay. An empty bottle? This doesn't belong here. I should recycle it. So it's two coins for the car wash. I think three for the paint job. Or maybe also two. Three for the paint job. Oof. Whoa, it's another empty bottle. I think I'll recycle it. Well we can farm bottles as well. Which is nice. Um I don't want to accidentally like trigger the game being done, so. This bottle doesn't belong on the ground. It should be recycled. Okay, currently we could do either one or the other. Or let's, you know what? Let's farm again. Farm one more time. Fast forward if you don't want to see <laughs> farming. Want to go back to the farm and pick us up a produce? I can do that. What do you need this time? Well, uh, let me see. Oh, I need a three of vegetables. It's the same like things. Baldini. You are a great helper, but, but. You know what would make me a better help? Not sponsored by better help is if it was different things to get. <sighs> All right. Well, let's just do that and then we can we can experience all the rest of experience in Pup Pet Enters the Race 1998. Um, which probably some of you out there are looking for. <laughs> you want to see what happens during the car wash? Probably not. Um, I wonder where I can find the fruits and vegetables Mr. Baldini asked for. I wonder if it's in the same locations they were last time. If it's not, I'll be a little sad. That's broccoli. That's 
the shake Mr. Baldini asked for. Yep. Okay. Then tomato and corn. And I think I can speed run this now, sort of, or try. I, I apologize for my use of the word speedrun, uh, <laughs> because this is not particularly mm, fast. Tomatoes. I need to pick something in that shape for Mr. Baldini. Oh, I see. They make it difficult by not telling you what they are and then just showing you the shapes. It would be a lot harder if it was different, different foods from last time. Keep going, Papa. You got this. I don't think Oops. I can pick anything there. Can you go out of bounds in this game? I wonder. Not sure what I did to cause that to happen, but farming, what a joy. I hope we still get two coins for this. You know, I'm actually kind of glad that there are mini games in this game that you don't need to do to complete, um, like, plot relevant tasks. I think that's kind of cool. I bet a young person in 1998 or later would have enjoyed that. Um, me right now. Slightly frustrated by it, but I'll need to put in one more bottle before I can recycle them. This isn't a real speedrun, so not that frustrated. <laughs> okay, three dollars. Hot ziggity! This recycling machine sure is neat! Maybe if I look around, I can find some more bottles to recycle. Maybe. Maybe. Won't be, because we will not. I mean, maybe I'll pick more up just in case there's an emergency that we need money for. Um, but yeah, Mr. Baldini. Hello, we have brought you fruits and vegetables. Thank you, Putt Putt. And just like I promised, here's a two of coins. Thanks. You're welcome. And if you want to fill up another produce box, you just let me know. Making money via bottle recycling is more satisfying to me than making money via farming. <laughs> and that probably says something about society. Um, okay, let's get a car wash first. One, two. That's one coin. 
That's two coins. Thank you. You may now drive through. Hot ziggity. Okay, let's do this. Oh my god. Me too, it's pretty cool. I love that this the shower curtain's open. Okay, wow. Is this water? Hooray! <laughs> and brushes? Oh, maybe we should have. Well, it's probably fine. I hope this is worth it. It's and wash it up. I don't know what this green thing does. It's the attack of the tickling brushes. Mm. <laughs> I didn't like that. I probably should have dried. That's fine. That's fine. I I wish for that brush to be in my house. Wait, did it steal things from me? Excuse me? Oh, all the junk. What, what was in here? It was just the bottle? Oh no. I don't like that that can happen. Well, luckily I don't think we needed that. Did we even have a bottle? Am I losing it? I don't know. Okay, don't panic, don't panic. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Cartoon color. Let's hope we don't need money to buy gas. That would be not good. That's one three. Now just two more and you're through the door. Oh, thank you. That's two, Buckaroo. Thank God. Now put one more coin in the slot, cowboy. I don't poke cows. I just honk at them. <laughs> okay. Cows do exist in this game. Confirmation. Oh, that's all free. Get ready to drive all through. I can't wait. Alright, folks, get ready for the tattoo parlor. Pick your color, Cowboy. My immediate thought, well, purple is the best out of these. Mm. Cool blue. Blue's cool. I think I'm going to like this. Now close your eyes real tight, Barton. Oh. Amazing. A tanning bed. Those are not covering. Okay. <laughs> Blue is cool. Here you go, sharpshooter. Take a look. Looking good. That was a blast. Can I do red instead? Fire engine red. Yep. Just like Smokey. I could oh just. Now close your eyes. Okay. Time. We're going with red. He's in a race. Might as well. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I feel kind of bad because Pup Pup is purple. I look good. <laughs> look at that confidence. You know what? I hate to do this. I hate to waste all this time. But I can't do this to Pop Foot. He's gotta be true. I 
hope this looks good. You've been purple before. Do you not remember? <laughs> okay, this feels good. This feels natural. Okay, Papa, it's time to enter the race. Hey, partner. Have a pee. First, we have to Great engage in some vanity. <laughs> wowie, zowie, I like that. Okay, here we go. All that time that we wasted <laughs> farming. That's fine. This bottle doesn't belong on okay. the ground. It should be recycled. Gas can. Oh, ah, good to know. That would have indeed brought us here. Okay. Oh, wow. That was fast. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, does this involve skill? Creative script, I like it. Just about to start. Okay. Start your engines. On your mark. Get set. Go! Oh my god. This does involve skill. Okay. Oh, I'd like to continue playing, please. How do I go faster? I don't know how to go faster. Avoid... avoid the bad things. Excuse me. Excuse me! <laughs> oh, it's not going well for Puppet. He is in last place. Please get out of my way, green car. Oh no! Okay, at least it's five laps. I used to be uh, on some later boards for Mario Kart Wii. I don't, I don't think my skills that I developed there are helping me now. Oh my god! Duck casualty! Duck casualty again! Oh, excuse me. Oh god. This is a dangerous racetrack. Popaki. <laughs> Not going well. Excuse me. I'm trying to drive here. I think they're doing this on purpose. Bro, bro, please. Yeah, he's he he's going in front of me on purpose. Is drafting a mechanic in Puffa enters the race? I doubt it. Oh, please move. That's okay. There's another lap. There's another lap. Oh no! Oh no! Speed up, Puffa! Speed up! Oh, oh, here we go, here we go. Oh. Oh god, oh god. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Go, go. You got this. Oh my god. Oh, he's really zooming. Keep going. You got this, Fuffa. Fu 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no problem. First place, baby. Oh, Pep is not doing well. Yes. <laughs> Amazing. How about that? First place. You were cruising. Way to go, buddy. Thanks, Redline Rick. So what do you say? I'm dancing. I'm dancing in real life. No. I think I raised enough for We got first place. Let's go to the winner circle. You don't get to re-race. <laughs> Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the champagne and most fastest racer in the car down 500. Thank you, thank you. Uh, way to go, buddy. Wow. <laughs> wow. Thanks a lot. I'd like to thank everyone in Car Town for helping me get all the things I needed. And Mrs. Airbag, I hope Ralphie doesn't hide any more hubcaps. I'll see you all next time. And don't forget, it's not if you win or lose, it's how you race around the track. Look at that. Inspirational messages. Not sure what the comment directed towards Mrs. Hubcap was about, but that's okay. Oh look, there's little pictures. Time to dance to our favorite song. I'll let the I'll let the credits roll. And I'll let everyone see these pictures. Thank you so much for joining me for this exciting conclusion of a different save file um, of Putt Putt and it's all the emu. It won in our hearts. Number one winner. Um, we did not interact with Outback Gal at all, but that's okay. Um, oh, some romantic tension. <laughs> I like that. I like these photos, they're good. Um, I hope you enjoyed this speedrun. I probably didn't place on any speedrun records, but I also don't know how to submit them as speedruns. Um, signing autographs. Um, but yeah, this has been this game. There's other Pug Pug games that are available. I think they're all older. There may be like a couple newer ones, but the animation style changed. Um, maybe not. Maybe not for all of the newer ones, but uh, there's one that's slightly older that I might be interested in playing. And the Pug Pug goes to the moon one is like significantly older and it looks a lot older but it could be fun um i i'm into astronomy <laughs> so the moon fits into those categories into that category um so that could be fun boy there's a lot of credits for this game huh the stevens of system programming hey if if you're watching this and you made the, this game, thanks. This is a great game. <laughs> um, oh, QA tester, what I wouldn't give. I think these are flowing by randomly, the, the photos. I wonder if we had been painted a different color. If, if all these photos would be showing Putt-Putt with a different color. Nancy Cartwright? What? <laughs> I can't believe! Thank you for your voice talents, all of you people. I couldn't read the names fast enough. So Putt-Putt is also Bart Simpson, huh? I think that's the same person. Wow, you learn something new every day. Day. Thank you for creating Pot Pot. He's a pretty cool little car. Oh. No copyright infringement intended. <laughs> if you lived in Car Town, you'd be home by now. We did it, folks. We did it.
Will it end? It's begun again. It's begun again. Let's stop. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, just quits the game. Wow. Can I, uh... Oh, it's quite small. I'll, I'll leave you... I'll leave you with this. In the Windows Picture and Facts Viewer, this game is called Putt Race. The ISO file is called that. I hope uh, you enjoy. I hope you have enjoyed this video, this series, two-part series. Uh, let me know if you want to see another Putt Putt game or another Nancy Drew game. And if it's a Nancy Drew game, which one? Because um, there's a lot. And I've played all of them relatively recently within the last five years, so I'm somewhat familiar with all the plots. Um, but I'm excited to hear what you all think, you or what you think you'd like to see, what you would like to see. Um, or look at the catalog of Putt-Putt games and tell me which one you'd like to see me fail to speedrun. <laughs> um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching and I hope you have a good rest of your day. Thanks again. <laughs> How do I do these videos? Um, happy July. Bye.